Hey, how's it going? One of the things that I've had a problem with people like Anita and many others is, you know, I, I basically I have a hard time taking seriously anyone who's going to wear tons of makeup and then complain about objectification of women. Doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, isn't part of makeup objectification? The usual goal is to be objectified, whether it's in the general public or if a job unfortunately requires it. It's not always for those reasons. Sometimes it's for things like artistic expression. I have a lot more respect for those who will complain about objectification of women who wear makeup for artistic purposes. I mean, it's, it's kind of got to be something that's a little bit, a little out of the ordinary. If it's to look like someone that's on Fox News, yeah, yeah don't tell me that's for artistic purposes, sorry. <laughs> it can also, very unfortunately, be because someone thinks they're ugly unless they wear it. That no one would really want to be with them unless they did, even as a friendship. Friendship? Friendship? A built-in shaming department for the general public. I think it should be part of equal opportunity and anti-discrimination policies so that no company is allowed to force their employees to wear makeup or high heels unless it's required of both sexes.